Hello there, greetings in the name of the Lord. This is Sule Emmanuel. Welcome to Jesus every day. Light for your daily path. Our topic today is time with the Father. And this is part one. And our Bible reference, Psalms 27 verse 4. Friends, one of the priceless counsels that Jesus Christ gave us in scripture is that we must give ourselves to prayer. He said in Luke 18 verse 1 that we should pray always and not lose hope. Anyone who desires to win in life must give themselves to prayer. However, people often ask if a long time in prayer is necessary. Some believe that if God knows everything, why must I pray so much? Why must I pray for so long? Friends, spending time in prayer is valuable and it has priceless benefits now as humans our minds can be clogged with so many things such that if we desire to hear the voice of god to obtain direction on various issues or we just desire for the lord to purge our lives then we must press to spend time in prayer you see, there are dimensions and provisions that are available in God that we will not gain access to if we don't understand the place of spending quality time in God's presence. In Matthew 26, scripture reveals to us how Jesus spent several hours in prayer. And when he returned to find his disciples sleeping, he woke them up and said, why could you not spend a minimum of an hour in prayer? Friends, spending time with God in prayer reveals a lot about us. It proves love. You will spend time with the one you love. It is proof of desire to receive. It is proof of our desire to be transformed from glory to glory. We must consciously start rising above anything that makes us undermine spending time with the Lord. It can be in our daily moments of fellowship. It can be during a period of fasting or prayer or even in our church gatherings. It truly pays to tarry in God's presence. This is God's reminder to us today that he pays to tarry in the presence of our God. I'd like you to please pay close attention to our wisdom push of today. Today's declaration and our daily Bible reading, our scriptures for the day, which is our day meditation, and our scriptures for the night, which is our night meditation. The Lord bless you richly in Jesus' name. Go have an amazing day in the name of the Lord.